Good morning Phonics Group and welcome to Thursday. We are continuing with our long eye graphene. Have you got your pencil and your paper ready? Okay, today's learning intentions. We are aiming to remember the five graphemes for long eye and to blend words containing these graphemes quickly. How will you know if you have achieved your target? You, that you can write the five graphemes for long I in 10 seconds. I've noticed that says four graphemes, but there are actually five that we've been learning. And that you can fast read at least five long I words. Let's give it a go. Write the graphemes for long I. 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Put your pencil down. Count that you have five. Did you remember the split digraph? I, letter I. I, I G H. I, the letter Y. I E split digraph. I E I. How'd you go? Did you get all five? Did you get four out of five? Well done. Okay, pencil down, let's read. I sh I ng I I I I. Right, getting our hands ready to segment. We're going to sound out each of these graphemes, then blend them together to read our word. M. Mm. I. My. Sh. I. Shy. So, sh. I. Shy. One syllable. K. Cr. Cry. K. R. I. Cry. One syllable. F. R. I. Fry. F. R. I. Fry. Another one syllable word. Ooh, I fly. Tell your neighbour or anyone near you one meaningful fly. If you're on your own, just tell it to me. Tell it to the screen. I wonder if you were thinking about a plane that flies. So that's the verb to fly. Or the noun a thing, a person, place or thing. In this case it's a thing and it's an insect. Fly. Okay, pick up your pencil and write for me the graphemes for long I. You have 10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, Zero. Take a look, check that you've got five graphemes. And if you left one out last time, just check to see it's there now. Did you get I, the letter I, 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 G, H, I, the letter Y, I, split digraph, I, E, I, I, E. How did you go? Did you get all five? Have you improved? Let's have a look. Put your pencil down. We're going to do some reading. I. 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 U. Sh. I. 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 
hi. Let's put that together so far. Hi. Hein. Hind. Interesting word. Hind. But. Hi. Fine. Find. Find. Hmm. What does bind mean? Bind means to tie up, okay? Sometimes I have to bind my tree to a stake. So I bind it with string or with a wide hessian and that stake keeps the tree growing straight. So bind means to tie up. What does hind mean? Hind talks about the back of something, okay? Hind, the back of something. Hind. Back to our segmenting and then blending together. Boo. Lie. Line. Blind. This word can have two meanings as well. Let's take a look. There's a person who is blind and another word for that also is vision impaired. We tend to use that these days, vision impaired. That means their vision has been impaired. It's not working. And this lady here has a guide dog, blind. And with that, that basically means if you're still not sure, the person cannot see, the, the sense of sight is not working. Okay, then we've got a blind, which you place on a window. You might have one of these at your house. You can open and close it as you wish to let light in or keep light out. Okay, ready? I, hi, s, I, sigh. <sighs> oh, no, it's not that one, it's sight. Here we go. S, I, t, s, I, t, sight. Is there another type of sight? So there's the sight our sight that we see with. And then there is this type of sight, S-I-T-E, places. So here we've got a picture of a construction site, but also when we travel or we go somewhere new, there are sites to be seen. So lovely places to be seen, lovely buildings. If you go into the city, there's um, the opera house, that's a lovely sight. Or as you travel over the bridge, the Sydney Harbour Bridge, another lovely sight. So S-I-T-E is a place. Okay, back to our reading. Brr, 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 I. Who thinks they knows what's, knows what's coming next? Maybe it's t. Brr, I. Right. I fight. These are all one syllable words. Right. Fight. N I T night. One syllable. Now we've got a split diagraph here. I wonder which consonant is going to go in there. Who thinks it's a d? It's wife. Wife. I was thinking it's wide. Maybe this one's going to be wide. What? I'd. Wide. D. 
I dive. I wonder if these holidays you were lucky enough to dive into some water. What do you think? Oh, fire. Fire. It could have been five, though. Hmm. I. Ice. Ice. I do like ice in my drinks, I have to say. I love ice in lemonade. Homemade lemonade. Ice. Ooh. Like. Like. We saw that one last time. Sm. Smile, smile, die. Hmm, what does this picture have to do with die? Well, when you've got more than one dice, if you've got more than one, the plural is die. So you might have two die or three die or ten die, but singular is dice. Plural is die. Bull, lie. Ready for fast read? Let's go. Shy, lie. Sky, fight. Lie, blind. Bind, mind. Sigh, die, high, bike, wide, wife. Write the graphemes for long I. Pick up your pencil. Ready, set, go. Ten. I'm going to clean my glasses while you do this. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Let's see how you went. Did you get I? I, I G H. I, the letter Y. I, split digraph. I, I E. One, two, three, four, five. Did you get all five? Well done. Let's read. I, 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 k, sh, I, 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 I. Okay, fast read sentences. Let's have a go. The Blind man has a dog. How about you have a go on your own? Great. Do you cry in sad movies? You have a go. Here's the challenge fast read. Let's give this a red hot crack. The highest ride at Wet and Wild always gives me a fright. Let's read it a bit more quickly. The highest ride at Wet and Wild always gives me a fright. So let's circle in the air all of the words with a long eye graphene. Highest, ride, wild, right. So point now to the split digraph word, ride. Well done. How did you go? Can you write the five graphemes for long eye in 10 seconds? Can you fast read at least five long eye words? Well done, everyone. See you next time.